Um, hello everybody, this is Jamie the D, the Mad Welshman, and, um, I am gonna be checking out Catacomb Kids, as soon as I've sorted it out, oh, well, never mind. <clears throat> Never mind. I am trying out Catacomb Kids. It is a game. Uh, it is keyboard. Or, indeed, con- Ah, uh, sorry, I'm having not a fun week. Right, let's just get into it. This is Catacomb Kids. It's an early access roguelike. There we go. Ah, I see. Okay. Oh, a good tutorial to start with. Ah, right. Okay, okay, okay. That. Just a scratch. Okay. Nice. Uh, oh, right, okay. Liking the animation. traps. Uh, okay. So, fish, as it turns out, are pretty nasty. Ugh. This is Jamie the D, the Mad Welshman, and this is, uh, yeah, yeah, I, w I would, uh, no. Ah, right, okay. Um, sprint up walls, auto evade traps while sprinting, trample enemies and burst through doors. Uh, okay, so the key build controls take a little bit of getting used to. But otherwise, I'm kind of liking this. Um, yeah, let's learn that. Ah, uh, right, this is quite clever. Thank you. 
Oh yeah, double tap. <sighs> Got it. About time. Interesting. Oh, wait. What was that? Mm, corpses can be looted with shift. Okay, so that's how it works. Interesting. Um, well, let's start with a standard warrior. Um, Lauren's good with axes, breath holder poised, always hungry. Messy eater. Yeah, let's give this a go. Okay. Oh, lovely. I've always loved Yoku blocks. Right. So we can actually throw potions. This much I've learned from watching other people. jump. Wait, did that not learn? <sighs> Seeky. Silly me. What's that? That's a bone. And that's a potion of might. We love those. Oh god, we don't love those though. And we've learned that fish are in Incredibly dangerous. So, uh, hmm, okay. Uh, hates hammers, magical weapon. Oh, oh, right. Well, let's. Stick with the bully for now, get more Katakum kids killed. Okay. No. Okay, what are you? You're a magic spell of some description. Uh, yeah, I would. I'm perfectly fine with double jump. Okay, we can actually direct our attacks some. And um, what's this? A glowing jacket, extra speed, extra luck, less intelligence. Yeah, why the hell not? Uh, 
And, uh, yeah, note to self. There are some tickly nasty traps. Oh, what's this? Hollow star. Oh. Well, um, let's try a different type then. Uh, hatchet, axe, short sword, spear. Spear, yeah, why the hell not? Uh, good shoes, breath holder, quite loud, which I would imagine lets enemies know you're there. Hate staggers, good shoes. Yeah, why the hell not? of regeneration. Okay. Um, shimmering amulet. Let's grab that. Jackpot. Um, jacket. Good halberd. Why the hell not? Um, like it's the lot. Chest, breastplate of heat. I don't see why not. Oh, right, there's another one of those hollow stars. Uh, let's see how that goes. Get over here. Okay, being aggressive seems to work. Um. Hmm. Uh, good falchion. Nah. Chest. That breastplate doesn't seem like it's going to be that cool. Okay. So we have directional attacks. We've got our orb of leveling. Okay. So, um, uh. Yeah, let's improve our speed. Uh, sprint at walls, auto evade traps while sprinting, trample enemies. Give me power! Yeah, alright, Dorcas. And of course, like any good dungeon, what we're meant to be doing here is. Finding the exit. Mm, no. There we go. That's better. Right. That was a potion of poison. Good thing I didn't use it. Someone. The 
Oh, so oh crap. <laughs> um Duh. Okay, what does temporal tricks teach us? Uh, slow spell, undo spell. Uh, yeah, why the hell not? There's our exit. But is anything interesting up here? No. Okay, well. Uh. God damn it. Okay. We know it did something. But we aren't quite sure what. Marriage deal. Jackpot. No. Amulet of health. of lightning. And that was quite lucky. Interesting. Uh, I'm not quite sure what the coin is for. Um, oh, right. Okay. Right. Well. Keeping on with this, let's uh, try uh, Magical Incline, Breath Holder, and Poised, but very low health. Oh, has an air dash. Well, you know what? Worth a go. Damn, these traps do not fuck around. Oh, oh no, oh no! Well, that was quick. <laughs> um, yeah, why the hell not? I, I wish I knew what even half of this was at the present time, but... Uh, oh, right, so this is the hammer. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, I like that. Oh, you little... Come here. Oh. 
that mean we just plain lost it? I think we did. Oh, man. what I wanted to do. Thank you. Um, empty bottle. Rock. Shit, there was something here. way we've got to be pretty damn careful. Oh that could happen. Kicked to death. Damn. Likes hammers. Um sod it, why not? And then we'll try a custom character. Okay, we got... Oh, God. Hate those. Right. Good breastplate. Mm, nah. That's crimson potion. And... And identify it as a potion of regen. <laughs> well, that's one way of murdering an enemy. Okay. Oh. Oh, this is a bad room. Yeah, let's uh, let's try a custom kit then. Okay. So, um, magical weapon. Okay. Um, defensive, good with weapon. Okay. Um, uh, these are unlocked traits, I think. Resourceful, okay. Yeah, I guess. Good with spears, um, of rending, that seems good. Oh, oh, right, wait, 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 yeah, okay, I'm starting to see, no, good, good with spears. Right, okay. Christina Miles, hates hammers, loud, breath holder, smooth halberd. Yeah, why not? Oh. 
Okay, I think we did okay there. That, however, is uh, a very dangerous room. Oops. I didn't actually mean to do that. Uh, I guess a shimmering amulet? Yeah, that's quite the dangerous room. I mean, to be fair, they're all dangerous. As aptly demonstrated. Hmm. Well. Oh, oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Right, we definitely need some form of healing now. Please be healing. Nope. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I'm actually having fun with how much this is murdering me. Um, good with swords, good shoes, magical armor, okay. I'm sure that will be incredibly useful. Potion of Might with one hit point. Okay, then. Well, there's the way out. Oh, apparently we set things on... F One of our abilities, we set things on fire while... Uh if we jump on them. Nice. So, we've still got to find that orb of leveling. And I suspect it's going to be in, like, Danger Town. Uh, 
does luck give us? Corpses leave behind more and better loot, getting lucky or descending slightly restores HP. Why the hell not? I mean, basically we're just trying shit out at the present time. Anyway, we found the uh, we found the orb of leveling. We appear to have survived this level, unless, of course, we do something stupid in the meantime. No? No? Cool to the touch. Okay, this will probably be a potion of ice, then. Okay. Yep. That was silly of me. Oh, well, magic in motion. A uh, free double jump. Yes. Test has a decorated buzzing broadsword. And last I checked, we were... Um... Oops. Uh, we got that. Got that. Traits, there we go. Um, we have sword skill. Oh, wow, I am liking you. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, venomous robe. Probably not as useful as I'd like. Oh, wait, no, no, no. What? Welp. Uh... Go on then, Billy. We're gonna kill an entire class. I don't care. Oh, you little git. Okay, can we actually learn anything here? Flame wave, wave of fire, ignite nearby ground. Let's go with what we learned. Whoa, what the heck is. Oh no! Stop, drop, and roll, baby! Okay, that's a health potion. God damn it. Nope. So I've got a few things to learn about throwing potions. And using them. And, well, a lot of things, really. Okay, we found the exit, at least. We're not sure what the orange potion it did, because the goo died. Okay. Damn it! No, no, no! Uh, 
Okay, Potion of Flames. There we go. <sighs> Identify an item. Yeah, that sounds like a plan. Um... Yeah, being Such able to... <laughs> I do like those little voice clips. Um... Okay, this... I'm not actually sure what to make of this now. Oops. Got stabbed. So we haven't entirely gotten rid of this, uh, this class. Oh, right, these guys... What are you using there, a dagger? Oh, yes, there we go. Crush traps for good and profit. Um, sharp machete. I don't see why not. Okay. Oh, this guy's tactical. Oh! And they use potions! Oh! Now this impresses me. Okay, what you got? You got crap weapons. What about you? Uh, you got crap too. Oh. Oh, right, okay, so killing enough of a thing. Tells you what the thing is. Okay. Um, buzzing crusher. Now, were we... Whoops. Uh, poise, gradually lose food queue. Oh, okay. Uh, reduce knockback use items faster. So it doesn't actually matter if we loot things. Uh, deadly distance. Uh, shove enemies. Chain lightning. I like that. Nah. Frostbolt. Go with what we know. Okay. So now we have a really big uh -oh. hammer. Oh, hello, Circle Master. What is this game that you play? Uh, this is Catacomb Kids, and, um... It's in early access. It's... Goodness me, it's got a surprising amount to it for an action roguelike. Like, wow. I am legitimately impressed with, um... Actually good potion ID. Uh, it gives you little clues the longer you hold a potion, for example. Um, sort of pseudo ID. Yeah. Yeah. Um, oh, yeah, we can't actually use that spell book yet, which is a shame because it has double jump. Um, we need to get a learning point via the orb. The orb of leveling. So, uh, seeing as this is a strength build, let's see what strength skills we have. Uh, we could grab and throw enemies, and we're unburdened by heavy items, which might be nice, because I suspect our mallet is a heavy item. It seems to be as big as you, so I would imagine so. Yeah, yeah, we're, we're not following monster hunter rules here, it seems. Um, now I could show off the potion ID, but let us do the only kind of potion ID that matters. Throw it at an enemy and see what happens. Yeah, and unfortunately, it was a potion of might. <laughs> well, that's what happens when you, uh, poor man's ID a potion that way. Yeah, well... 
That's why real men drink potions themselves. Look, I'm a man who's got double jump now. Well, at least this game admits that double jump is magic. Well, damn right it is! As opposed to so many games that just let people do it without realizing or admitting that it really flies in the face of every law of physics. Oh, yeah. Um, lots of things can be lit on fire. Fire is actually one of the more worrying things to me in this game. Oh, come on. There we go. Alright. What's that? That's a skull. Uh, so lots, lots of throwable items and oh god, I really should get better at identifying traps. That hurt. Hey, you'll be fine. You got a whole pip left. Uh, I hate to tell you, but that pip is like one hit. Hey, their action roguelikes for one hit is all you get. Oh, <sighs> thankfully, if I find some enemies, I can actually norm on them. There we go. Dead rat healed me. Which is good, because otherwise rats are assholes who will steal your shit. Well, all your shit lit on fire and you threw it away, so I'm not sure if you have anything left to steal. No, no, no. No, I've, I've done okay. Right, now that guy... Oh, boy. Yeah. So, good job on, um... Making me worry about goblins and orcs. So you may have noticed we're, uh... We're a little short on people in this class. <laughs> Wait, so, when a, a class, like, the class is not available? Hold on. I no, 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 you, um, work. okay, these gravestones, um, you can roll- like, obviously these are characters that you played and died. Yeah. Yeah, and you start off with a full bunch, but you can either roll another random kid for two coins, which is like, you, you get one coin a level, I believe. Um, or you can roll a custom kid for five coins minimum, but it ramps up quickly. <laughs> right now, I... <laughs> right now, I just want to kill an entire class. <laughs> uh, dare I ask where these kids are coming from? Because um, it kind of sounds like you're dealing in human trafficking here. I very You're well may paying make... money for child soldiers. Oh, right. Um, I think we uh, lost an arm. Is that a specific effect, or does this game like just model limb damage? Oh, nice. Um, there are certain kinds of damage that it will definitely, uh, right. Uh, we are a strength build, so a little extra speed wouldn't actually go, um, oh my god, what was that? Oh, that was an arrow thing. Oh, wow. Alright, I just saw another pop-up that said arm severed. If you already lost an arm, how are no, you No, I think anything? I severed someone else's arm that time. Oh, well then just take it and put it on your stump and you'll be fine again. Oh, oh, oh. That's... that's poison. And that's a spike trap. That is a nasty trap room. Oh, no. I got no reputation for that. Oh well.
<laughs> like, I'm having too much fun. <laughs> Murdering children. You... you can say it, you're having too much fun murdering children. Come on, lizard man. Come at me. Well, I had to say come at me, didn't I? <sighs> I think that's called hubris. Oh, oh, no, no, no. It does actually refresh. I was curious. <laughs> oh, you get free kids once you've killed enough. Yes. Yes, I do. Ugh. <laughs> is it broke? Okay, so it is broken down by class. Yep. So you just get an assortment of randos of each class to pick from, and you can re-roll them or customize them for coins. Yeah. But otherwise, you just get infinite randos. Yeah, that's about the state of it. Well, then why would you ever pay coins to re-roll... When you can just kill everyone and get a free reroll. I don't actually know. Um, however, I definitely see the appeal in the custom characters. Oh, right, okay. That was a potion of regeneration then. That was... Oh. I... Either that guy was very, very... Oh, dear. Oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear. Doors instantly jib corpses. Good to know. Well, you are slamming a door on a corpse. It's not going to put up much of a resistance. I don't know. I've, I've slammed doors on a couple of corpses in my time. And generally... Were, were they sturdy oak dungeon doors, or were they flimsy modern home doors? They, they were pretty sturdy, yes. Because these are like the dungeon doors that have the iron hinges, and they groan as they swing open and close. If you slam one of those on a corpse, <laughs> I think the corpse is going to fare a lot worse than it would if, you know... Your French doors at home got slammed on your thumb and it hurts. There's kind of a wide berth between those two versions of reality. So, uh, welcome to the stream chat where we're talking. <laughs> <laughs> we're talking about the game, man. The game jibs corpses on doors. Let's just get into it. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay, so, uh, we've taken a look at speed, luck, intelligence, let's see what the first skill for defense is. Uh, attack just before being hit to do a strong parry, or disarm foes when your weapons clash or upon critical hits. Either one of those is good! I think the block one you have more control over. Uh, so that's probably a better option. Yeah, yeah. Rats. Okay. Uh, I would just like to call out the expression on this poor child's face during that level up screen, by the way, of this sort of pitiable smile, as with the raised eyebrows, like, please, please, can I not do this? Well, I mean... Or you sent it further into the dungeon. Well, they're going further into the dungeon anyway. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm more worried about how this kid is not setting off the traps. In fact, I want to know well, how this Well, it's some rogue kid... type, isn't it? Uh, harder to detect, hold your breath, meals heal less, meals don't impart extra benefits. Uh, so it's not that. Um... Aha! Gossamer shoes! 
Okay. I mean, that makes perfect sense. <laughs> and, ooh, Dark Art Spellbook. Um... So, invisibility, vampirism, that does. Uh, plague, nah. Raise a corpse, uh, I think vampirism. Yeah, vampirism is a generally always useful ability. Yeah. Okay, well, uh, we actually made it to floor two this time. <laughs> And I notice we've got a throwing. Oh wow, when we get a combo off. Right, so that is, as far as I can understand. Um, right, you bog off. Thank you. There we go. Alright, what's this corpse got in it? Uh, crap jacket, a good spear. I do like a good spear. Well, Spears seem important. Um, we've already got good sandals. That looks like nothing more than a reason to uh, get spiked. Okay, can we eat the bat? We can eat the bat. Pipe to floor four. Wait a minute. You got vampirism and you ate a bat. Isn't that cannibalism now? No. I don't know where you got that idea. It could be a vampire bat. Oh, nice. We can actually control moving that rock. Nice. Oh, oh, oh. Teleport trap. I could have taken the pipe. I could have taken <coughs> the pipe. <coughs> um. Mm, Sorry about that. That's okay. Uh, okay. So, do we want a mage with a dagger, a partisan, or an axe? Partisan. Partisan. Okay. Magical armor, resourceful. They are also loud and hungry. So they start off with temporal step. Hmm, interesting. How many steps can you take in the frozen time? Ah, well, it's also a damaging uh, spell. And we do, in fact, have a point to spend on. Ooh, I don't know. Uh. Frostbolt. I just have a soft spot for Frostbolt. Okay, you have a spell option called Chain Lightning, but you went for Frostbolt instead. Yes. What is wrong with you, Jamie? Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> right, it's that hubris again. I like being one of the cool kids. Uh, ah. <laughs> yeah, that's right. You're yeah. gonna get a frosty reception with wordplay like that. I somehow think I'm not the one who uh, came off the worst there. Yeah. Um. Less magic. 
Hmm. Should I take a breastplate with less magic? No. God, no. Yeah, that looks pretty terrible. Instead, run, 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 run! Fucking pressure plates! I hate them! My orange potion is warm to the touch. And yet, it's a lightning potion. Have you been hit by lightning? Ah, uh, no! No! Roll! 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 No. Oh. <laughs> Having burst into flames, you're still not sure what that clear potion did. No. And we'll never know. <laughs> Oh dear. This is actually quite fun. Okay, so we. Oh, right. Do you know? It's taken me, uh. almost an hour. Yes. To do what? To work out that you can actually hold certain items rather than, you know, just use them. Okay. Oh shit. What was that? Right. Oh god, that's a lot of people and I'm burning! Roll, roll! What the ever loving. Well, it's your own fault for going into your inventory instead of guarding that ledge like you were. You could have. Killed all of those guys super clean if you had just ledge guarded. Have you not played Super Smash Brothers? Right. What's this? This is a bow. Oh no! Oh no! My my robot son! Wait, you care about that child? But not this child. Yes. Ugh. Like his motor and his rotor and everything are just Oh god no, no. the rest of him. God damn. <laughs> Circle. Yes. I got ambushed by a slime. I'm sorry, Jamie. Bad swimmer, where do we start the bad swimmer? <laughs> uh, Apropos. Yeah. Right, no. It really emphasizes the fact that you're really just here to torture children. Ah, uh, ah, uh, no, 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 don't you dare poison me, you bastards. Okay, the barrel, I, ah! Don't you steal my spellbook, you bratty little bastard.
Holy. Oh, oh, oh. Right, the flaming, ker the hot kernels. <laughs> That's right. Dungeon popcorn. <laughs> <laughs> Also, you know, like, lots of overheal from basically potato. <laughs> Potatoes are delicious when cooked properly. When cooked properly, but th this is a dungeon. Do you really think that's going to be the case? This is a dungeon. The best way to cook something is with a huge fireball. <laughs> Oh, wait, more potatoes. Gotta eat all the potatoes. And slime. I just, I just had potatoes with dinner tonight. They were delicious. Hmm. I also had some potato-based stuff. Okay, level up. Um, these are mages, so... Magic or intelligence would probably be a good idea. I don't know. I would say intelligence, just because you don't seem to be spamming out spells very much. Uh, Although I don't know how well the magic actually regens. Okay. Ah, right. Yes, you actually, uh, you actually did a good thing. Right, what was in? What was in the chest? Nothing. Oh. Oh. Yeah, great. So remember that our character is a bad swimmer. I do remember that. Um, oh dear. I do hope this isn't one of those cases where I either have to do a silly jump. Uh, crap. I think this is... Oh, oh, no, 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 wait. I can just use the teleport trap. <laughs> oh. I would have laughed if it teleported you into more water. Oh, wait, it teleported you above more water. Yeah. Oh, I missed you, you get. Nonetheless, there's uh, there's a lot of stuff to take a look at. Um, hmm. So drink the potion or throw the potion. Drink the potion. Drink a potion for once. Come on. I did. Uh So at least we know if we fell down there that uh, the teleport trap would save us. Which is certainly some words I just said. Well, that's how teleporters usually work in roguelike games. They can be blessings as often as curses. Yeah, I was, I, I was waiting for you to answer as often as curses, because... Like, grr, teleport traps. Okay, uh, just bog standard shoes. Ah, mm. uh, no! I heard. Yeah. I heard it. And then. And then quickly wrote it down in your encyclopedia. And Speaking of, we should actually take a brief <laughs> look at that, shouldn't we? I don't know, it's your stream. <laughs> the world! That... Yes, that that's good. Okay. <laughs> Devices and traps. Um... Um... 
Ah, right, you can actually break the chains. There you go. We've learned a thing. And learning is half the process of knowing. And knowing is half the battle, therefore learning is one quarter of the battle. Mm. Of course. I guess the second quarter would be recruiting kids to murder. You... you just... <laughs> what if you to acknowledge it? <laughs> you have to acknowledge this... this atrocity that you are committing. I know video games usually involve the players committing various atrocities, but you always have to acknowledge what you're doing. Yes, okay. Why do you the, acknowledge it? This is a game about sending... Oh no! Not again! <laughs> This is a game about sending uh, teenage dungeoneers to their deaths. <laughs> I mean, there's really no other way of putting it. Thank you. <laughs> right. Okay, maybe this time we will not be crushed. Oh, that dude has a helmet. Maybe that'll help him from being crushed to death. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Mm. Do we have a trait? Uh, hungry, gradually lose food, make noise when landing. Uh, what equipment we got? We got a helmet. We got a clean breastplate. Um. Yeah, honestly, there's nothing that really recommends. And I would have laughed if I'd have been able to. Just murder everything like that. Uh, because Goomba stomping is a thing. So it would seem. Like a boss. Okay, we need to get out of there and... Hmm. Are we... Right. Can we destroy the chain? Yes, we can! Oh my god, we destroyed... Not very effectively, but uh, oh no! Eventually. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no, not again! There's no shame in that method of death, though. I Again. could have thrown it. Yeah, but but learning, we've established learning is one quarter of the battle, <laughs> as opposed to just getting smashed by a random trap. That's shameful. Or you know, eating bats. Well, eating bats is shameful for different reasons. Oh, um... Oh... There we go. Alright. Well, I was gonna Goomba stomp that slime, but my reflexes are... Tat. It's not lie here. Tat. Ah, oh, dear. Okay. What have we got in here? Durable Warhammer. Mm, I don't know. What is your current equipped weapon? Some sort of axe, it looks like. Yeah. Oh, God, that... That was certainly a set of traps. Yeah, you're fine. I mean, I'm fine now. You mean you're fine for now? Yes.
fine enough that, you know, I, I get to be able to swear at Yoku blocks. I, I really don't understand why any modern game would have Yoku blocks, given that they're never done well. No, 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 no. Let, let's, let's put this in its proper terminology. They are Satan's unwashed asshole. Even so, there are varying degrees, and at least this game shows you where the where the Yoku blocks are, as opposed to, like, say, the original Mega Man games, where they just appeared out of nothing, and you had to know where they were ahead of time. True. Or you just lost. Um, so I liked that flame wave. We don't have the energy to use it, but I liked it. Oh no! You can't blame me for that one. I, I don't know why you didn't use your cheating magic to just double jump out of the way of that. Well... This has been Catacomb Kids. It's a fun game. It's a fun game that murders the hell out of me, and I have yet to get to the second area. Um, but if you've been watching the stream, uh, you'll realize, yes, I've actually been having a lot of fun with this. I thought you got to floor two once. I got to floor two? But I didn't get to the second biome. Oh. <laughs> How would you even know there was more than one? <laughs> ah, well, that's the wonderful thing called looking at the store page before you buy it. <laughs> ah. <laughs> anyway, um, right, awful start aside, this has been Jamie the D, the Mad Welshman, and uh, co-commentator Circle Master. Thanks for having me. And, uh, yeah, if you liked the stream, such as it was, <laughs> the reviews or the art, um, please take a look at my Patreon, my Ko-fi, or my PayPal Amy. Take care now.